Azerbaijan. Excellent. This, this uh, big East, all this moving around, what, what do you think of it just as a fan, like seeing that all these teams going everywhere? Yeah. I don't know. Uh, obviously, you know, the Big East has been a great conference for many years. I was reading an article today in the Post, him saying, you know, basically since 1789, Big East has been a premium conference, and it will continue to be a premium conference. Uh, obviously, with all the movement, it's starting a lot of controversy with schools wanting to leave, staying, and this, that, and that. But honestly, at the end of the day, you got to go out and you got to play whatever whatever sport you feel is in. You got to go out and play Who, whoever's in the conference who's not in the conference. So my job, honestly, is to focus on Georgetown University. So, you know, whatever happens at Georgetown University is, is what happens at Georgetown University. So. When, when you chose Georgetown, did you weigh at all kind of the identity of Big East basketball? Absolutely. That, um, that didn't play the major fact, uh, right. factor. Right. I, I mean, I, I was a Hoya from, from birth, so, okay. um, so it, it, you know, obviously growing up, you know, watching a lot of Big East basketball, you know, having, having lived in the area, so I, I already came in with the tradition of excellence, you know. And, and that identity that it had to you, what, yes. what was it? How would you describe the character um, that you associated with Big East basketball? Big East basketball is, is in my opinion, one of the probably most competitive conferences yeah. in the country. Um, you know, of course, you know, you, 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 you grow up in, obviously I was a little bit young during the John Thompson area, but I had parents that was, that lived in, during the John Thompson area, so that was instilled in our, in our home, you know, going out competing every day, playing hard, you know, just, you know, com competing, and that's what this university, university is about, and, and also the Big East, it's about going out competing, uh, giving it your best effort, and, you know, whatever, whatever happens after that is what happens after that. Now, all this movement, like I said, this, you know, it, it, it creates, you know, it creates an atmosphere where it's a lot of controversy. It's, you know, you're getting, you're getting that lax, a lot of questions. Sure. So, you know, but, you know, obviously, we're Georgetown, whatever happens. I guess, I guess, though, just online, what she was saying, you know, you talked about that identity, that Georgetown identity, that Big East identity. Do you think that will weaken as, as the conference is perceived to be weakened? Um, I think the conference is going to do everything humanly possible, you know, to make sure that, you know, the conference is, is, is at its best. I don't think that they're going to do anything to make Big East any weaker or anything like that. I think the Big East is going to be the Big East. It's not, I don't think it's going to sway either way. I think the Big East is going to be what it is. You do play Tennessee Wait. tomorrow night. Yeah, I know. Yeah. So can I get some of those questions? Well, I'll get you kind of a, a half step toward that. <laughs> when you go into this game, which is part of the Big East SEC challenge, okay. I mean, I'm quite sure your loyalty or your main goal is to get the win for Georgetown, but are you conscious of this conference versus conference sort of subtext of this game? Um, social media pumps it up to, to um, be... Be, to be a conference versus conference, I mean, that's it's Tennessee on our schedule, and I'm pretty sure that, you know, uh, you know, with, with everything, uh, sort of say that the Big East SEC, arguably, in my opinion, mm -hmm. are the two best conferences in the country. Um, so for us, it's a big time, it's a big time game. You, two years ago, UConn wins. Last year, Kentucky mm -hmm. wins. So mm -hmm. Big East SEC. So there's gonna be some good basketball played tomorrow. Um, and then I, I was asked earlier, you know, is you know the Big East SEC, you know, is, is, it a, is it a major factor for the Big East to win this? And I was like, oh, hey, the Big East conference was built on winning. You know, I, like I said, I read the article in the post today, uh, and I and I honestly did not know this. In the '80s, it seemed like the Big East was probably the most dominant conference. You know, having won the us having won the uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the championship in '84. Um, Three out of four, yeah, five, four. exactly. And then Villanova went in, and actually that year, mm -hmm. I didn't know three of the four teams in it were in the Big East Conference. So, yeah. you know, I think that stands out. And you know, even even in recent years, you know, in recent years, um, the Big East is the major conference in my opinion. All right. Awesome.